Okay. What's up, guys? It's your boy, BatLedger52, back at it again with another DC Ledger review. And today is a Legend review for Cheetah. Now, Cheetah is in the new Wonder Woman 1984 movie that just came out. And Cheetah here has been in DC Legends for a while. I just never... I've had her unlocked, but I never clicked on her yet. Um, so, this is Cheetah. So, um, this is what Cheetah looks like in the comics and basically everything else. She's more of an orange than uh, blonde or white. With uh, She's a redhead most of the time. But the movie, it's still sick, though. It still looks like Cheetah. It's really dope. But um, let's upgrade her. Her first thing for Cheetah is God Killer Knife. Then Cheetah has um, Totem of Urkazaga, whatever, however you say that. So um, Cheetah is clearly a Wonder Woman villain. And then she has Totem of Fury. And she has Totem of Technicity, however you say that. Then Cersei's Potion. Then PhD in Arcology. Archaeology, or whatever, you know. So, Cheetah here is a... Ooh, okay, okay. Alright, alright. So, Cheetah here... Cheetah is a Wonder Woman villain, clearly. And Cheetah is a four-star. But, um... She'll be higher in the future, eventually. But for now, she's a four-star. Her bio, Cheetah, Avatar of the Hunt... Affiliations, Injustice League, powers, savage animal powers granted by the cheetah spirit. Relic hunter Barbara Minivira paid a high price when an ancient dagger transformed her into the fearsome half-human cheetah. While on an exploration in Africa, uh, a mortal treasure hunter Barbara and Minervia uncovered the lost Urkazagan tribe. <laughs> Craving the powers of the cheetah spirit, Minervina forced their priest to perform a magical ritual on her, but the god whatever demanded a blood sacrifice to complete the ceremony. By murdering her companion with a mystical dagger, Minervira was granted ferocious powers, but also cursed with bloodthirsty appetites. And she's kind of stuck like that, too. You know, she kind of, got, kind of get what you deserve, I guess. But that's what she wanted, you know. I don't really think she could turn back. She's kind of stuck. Um, but her first move is Swift Sash, Ravage, and Blood in the Air. Then she has Ambush Killer. Passive ability, 35% chance to gain two strength ups if a member or any teammate takes bleed, disease, or damage. Ooh, okay. And then she has Team Leader. All allies have 20% chance to gain 20% turn meter damage, a bleeding target, or apply bleeds. Hmm. Okay, okay. I like those cool daggers on the side there. So, um, with that being said, though, let's go check out Cheetah's moves. So, that's almost all for Cheetah here. She is a four star, but she will definitely be higher in the future. Where is she at? Oh, come on, she's a four-star. She shouldn't be that far back. There's Cheetah. Okay. So, Cheetah here is a four-star, but she will definitely be higher in the future still. Four-star, five-star, legendary over there. She'll definitely be higher in the future, but for now, she's a four-star, you know? But that, that's fine. She's still gonna whoop ass here, bro. She's gonna beat the crap out of him. So, her first move is Swift Slash. Light damage and apply two bleed to an enemy. Just one enemy. So she runs up, claws the crap out of them. Just slashes them, you know, with their claws. And her second move can be applied to all teammates. Or just any teammate. Hold on. No, just any teammate. You only get to pick one, though. 
Ravage. Damage to an enemy. Purge one buff. Oh, okay, so she runs up to him and claws the crap out of him. Like, 15 times, you know? Just rah, 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 claws him to death, right? Now, her third move can be applied to herself and other teammates. Basically, the whole team and definitely herself. Blood in the air. Apply one strength up to all allies. 30% chance to apply one extra strength up and apply one extra strength up per bleeding enemy. Rar. Okay, so she gives the team strength ups. And, you know, especially if there's a bleed around. You know, so. give She, can, she definitely gives them bleed, clearly. She gives them bleed by clawing them to death. Give them bleed. Yes, every time she claws them, she basically gives them bleed. Even if they're a robot, so that's... Not quite how that works, but okay. So she's about to get knocked out, probably, but... Cheetah's still pretty OP. I definitely recommend her for your team if you're trying to, like, make the enemy bleed a lot. So you can try to drain their health out. And boost up their strength power. But she did get knocked out, but that's fine. Uh, but, I mean, with that being said, though, I think that's all for this legend review. This thing's like right by my neck. Hold on. I think that's all for this legend review for Cheetah. Where the frack is she? There she is. Okay. I think that's all for this legend review for Cheetah. But with that being said, uh, if you guys like this video, uh, hit the thumbs up and consider subscribing. And with that being said, I'll see y'all in the next video.